I'm Sham Sakrani. I work in the Applied Data Science Centre, uh, and I am a manager in strategy planning and business operations. Life sciences companies have uh, a big challenge with the complexity and the inclusion exclusion uh, criteria of trials going up, with the costs of trials going up, uh, and the number of eligible patients ultimately due to this extra complexity going down they have issues in being able to get their molecule to market quick enough. Now, if we're able to leverage real-world data uh, in order to find these eligible patients, would A, benefit the hospitals because they would be able to um, run their trials more efficiently and get more patients uh, into the trials, would benefit us because we'll be able to run our trials quicker, and would ultimately benefit patients because they wouldn't be called in for trials that they weren't eligible for, means that we're able to get the drug to the right patients quicker. So we've been working with the UK healthcare team uh, on a pilot. The pilot is to uh, understand how we can utilize this information and this infrastructure that they've already built, these data sets that they already have access to, in order to identify patients uh, who could be eligible for trials that we are running at these hospitals. What is innovative about this is the use of a benchmarking solution that has a completely different use case originally when it was sold to hospitals. Um, so I think it speaks to the power of us as a company. Because we have so many solutions and so many points of interface with uh, parts of the health system, we're able to leverage um, something that originally did not have any use for clinical trials in the clinical trial space. Mm -hmm.